no one is in the classroom. So I guess today I will talk to you about what you do in a student no-show. Yes. Okay, so this is the trial class that I was about to teach. I entered the classroom on time and no one is here. So at this point, I'm going to take this and cover the camera. Okay, your camera is open, but you just pop that right over and then they cannot see you. I've also muted my microphone. Now, for a trial class, you have to wait in the classroom for 15 minutes. Okay. So, keep your headset on. Stay at your desk for 15 minutes, okay? Do something else, um, because if you take your headset off and they show up in the class, you won't hear them, right? Um, there is a little trick that you can do. I'm using the app, so I'm going to just minimize my app. I can still hear if they show up, I'll know, and I'll click right back on, pop the thing off, and start class. But I'm going to go to my browser, my Chrome, and open that up. Um, if you're not teaching through the app, just open up a new page. I used to really worry because this computer is really old and I was afraid it was going to crash on me. But so far so good and now I have a backup computer if it does crash. So you go into your regular browser and open up VIP Kid Teachers Portal <clears throat> so that you can go to your Classrooms tab. Now I'm going to show you. La, 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 la. My hair was really greasy today and it's Saturday and I'm gonna go do a bunch of yard work so I didn't want to like wash it so I just put it in pigtails. It's okay. Okay, so let's see if I can do this. You're gonna go. Here's your page. Go to your classrooms tab. Now see down here I still have my VIP Kid Teacher app open. See, this is my this is where the student is not here and I'm at two minutes and just waiting so I minimize that and now I'm in my teacher portal through my browser now I'm gonna look and see this is my eight o'clock class it doesn't say student no-show so I still have to stay in the class but I'm going to leave this open because once it says student no-show I can leave the classroom even if it's not at 15 minutes okay what is recommended is that when you do leave the classroom, that you take a screenshot that you were there. Okay, so some people want to play it safe and they will want to take a screenshot at the beginning of class, stay 15 minutes, take a screenshot at the 15, and then leave. Um, I haven't had any problems yet checking when it says no show and then leaving. You probably want to take a screenshot of the no show and it shows the time on your screen and a screenshot of when you left the classroom. Um, screenshots shots are important in case there's any dispute, but I have not had any problems. So personally, I recommend that you do open another browser, go in your classrooms and see if it says no show. Now you want to refresh every so often because, you know, just to see if it showed up yet. And every once in a while, I pop back over to my classroom and see there's still no one here. I'm at four minutes, okay? So I'm going to hang out and do something while I wait. That is what you do, and I will keep you posted on the rest. Hey, guys, so now it says student no-show. So I wanted to show you. La, 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 la. I swear I will get one of those screen sharing things so I can do this better but for now here we go right here this is the eight o'clock class it says finish student no show so now I can go I'll just minimize this and I can go back to my app okay and see we're only at seven minutes and 41 seconds but because it says teacher no show I am free to go and I am not taking a screenshot because I haven't had any problems yet. I'm sure once I have problems, I'll start taking screenshots. But my advice to you is take screenshots if you are concerned. So I'm going to exit the classroom. I do not 
do any, you don't do any stars or anything if they didn't come. I don't do feedback for trials that don't come. Um, uh, yeah, so that's it. So now I have an 8.30 trial. So if they show up, then we'll get a chance to talk about, to see what I do in class. Anyway, that's what you do for a student no-show.